good morning to you so it's monday uh i am feeling energetic i can't connect my mic to this <gasps> wait my check one two one two does this not sound better i'm just gonna clip it here for now the top of my head is cut off let's see can i can we make that better that works hello welcome to my youtube channel if you're new here i I definitely recommend you subscribe. We're going to be going on a beautiful journey. But um, thank you. Thank you so much for tuning in. And when I woke up this morning, I was like, oh. It really felt like a Monday, even though we're in quarantine right now. And um, I'm just going to go on a little bit about how um, quarantine has been like for me. First, first, I started up here. I was like, yes, I love my own space. It hit me that like. I'm not saying working out was my escape, but I really enjoy my time to just stretch, work out. And that sort of took a toll on my body because I don't normally do anything at home besides dancing. Dancing just to reach my 10,000 step goal on my Fitbit. But then I would have done like five or 6,000 steps prior to that. So trying to dance out 10,000 steps day one and day two was achievable. And then it became unrealistic. So day three, I was like, Nyark! because it was a bit unrealistic. It didn't really work out for me. And I just found myself in a bit of a slump. But um, now I am back at it. I don't even know what day of quarantine we're on. And I created some stuff. Um, you would have seen... You would have seen some... Um, You may have seen these earlier. If you follow me on social media, I am on Instagram. Check out my Instagram. That's where I normally like announce stuff first. So I've been doing this um, Color With Me series because I figured a lot of us at home are bored. Something to do. And you're never too old to color in. And you don't even have to print these. I created one of Perth. You can't, it's not really very clear, but I did one for Perth. Gokwe, shout out Gokwe, my hometown. Um, I am very scared to pronounce this. You can actually, you can have me in the comments because I'm about to pronounce this so wrong. Stuttgart. Eek. Have me in the comments, it's fine. We can have some fun. Uh, <laughs> and then I have Keitan. And either today or tomorrow, I am done with the next one. I'm planning to create a series of 10. Hey! I'm just surprised that somebody that I thought was asleep is actually awake. You know who you are. But today or tomorrow, I'm dropping a new one. And guess what the city is? It's in Australia. If you want to take part in guessing what the city is, this is me being optimistic that this video is dropping today because I said I'm posting this either today or tomorrow. But hey, in the comment section below, guess what the city is? I created this whole series by Procreate. It's absolutely free. You can either download it or print it and then use any form of media, paint or Copic markers, anything that you feel that you'd like to use or comfortable with. Or you can actually just download um, the digital version and then upload it into Procreate and you can work your color magic. And if you are using Procreate, I have created um, a set of free brushes that you can use that I've actually been using recently. So most of my most recent work on Instagram is actually using my very own brushes, which is very nice. Um, and the brush set is called Kujga brushes. There are three brushes in the set. I'm just gonna actually just show the little words for the different brush, but not the actual strokes. If you're interested in downloading it, it's absolutely free. Check out the link. In the description it's free so it's three brushes maputi muriwo sadza maputi is traditional not traditional but it's um unique to zimbabwe it's like popcorn but next level popcorn the seed is bigger the popcorn is bigger it's called maputi it's delicious then the next brush is called muriwo which is if you're in the states or familiar with this term colored greens that's what muriwo is colored greens fried 
greens, delicious. And then the last brush, it's a series of three, is called Sadza, which is a staple across many countries in Africa, including Zimbabwe. But in Zimbabwe, it's called Sadza. It's a maize starch. My favorite. Uh, so that's just me introducing my brushes, my sketch with me stuff. If you're interested, check out the link in the bio. Share with anybody else that you feel would like something like this or would benefit from anything like this. And I would really love to see what you create. I'm always so excited when somebody sends me what they've done with the different coloring and sheets. Like, it literally makes my heart smile. So download it, do what you want with it, and tag me or pop me a message, email me, DM me. Let's do this. Bye. <laughs> oh, this is terrible.